boom, look at that. Cooking up uh, some salmon patties, you know, I'm gonna make some salmon burgers. Just a can of uh, pink salmon, because that's cheaper than red salmon. And this is just like making salmon cakes, except for a salmon burger, I usually put two eggs in instead of one egg. And if you've never used canned salmon before, look how, look at that liquid in there. You wanna drain that off, and man, it's a horror show. When you get out of this can, holy smokes. You need to be emotionally prepared for that mess, right? Look at that skin. That's just a segment of salmon, boom. They lopped it off and threw it in a can. And you know, in the canning process, it gets cooked. So this isn't raw, this is already cooked salmon. See, I'm draining off that extra liquid? Because you want it to have as little liquid as possible. You know, when you're making these uh, salmon burgers. There's bones in there, there's skin in there, but you can eat all that. You know, I used to take the bones out and the skin off, and I still do if I'm making like a salmon salad. See, that's a little vertebrae part of the spine. I don't know, I'm not a damn scientist, but look at that, look how powerful I am. But you can do that too, you can just crush the bone in your finger, because the bones are soft and you can eat them up, you know. So smash it up, season it however the hell you like. I'm just throwing some salt and pepper in here. Sometimes I put cayenne pepper, but I'm putting some fresh pepper in here today. Uh, sometimes I even put it in a, like a tablespoon of curry and make a curry burger. But you know, you can try that. But season it however the hell you like. I got some onion in here. You know, dice that stuff up fine, super fine. And then two eggs, whisk it, throw it in there, mix it up, because the egg's gonna help to hold it together. You know, I don't like putting in uh, breadcrumbs or crackers or anything because I don't want to dilute, you know, my salmon taste. You know, I want the full force of the salmon, right? So go ahead and get it all mixed up, you know, and it's fun. You know, it's like being at the beach, you know? Look at me, you can make a little sand castle, just like on the beach, you know, and you, then you can be like a Godzilla, you know, knock it over or whatever. Or, you know, but eventually you'll have to come back to the real world and, uh, just fix your damn dinner, you know? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna split it up into four balls, boom, because I'm gonna get four burgers out of here, like four quarter pound salmon burgers. Heat you up a little bit of oil in a skillet, you know, like three or four tablespoons. Don't be shy with the oil. I got it on uh, medium heat. Make, make sure your skillet's hot before you put your uh, salmon patties in there, you know, shape them into nice burger sizes. And then the key for making these salmon patties, you know, whether you're using them for a burger or not, is to just leave them alone. You know, let them get a nice cooked side before you start to fool with them. You know, because I got a big skillet here and uh, my burner isn't quite uh, big enough under there, I'm going to go ahead and rotate them a little bit so that the outer side that isn't cooking as much as the inner side gets cooked. Because you want a nice cooked side so that they don't fall apart when you try to flip them. And when you do flip them, you know, be gentle. See how I'm doing it with my hand there? But you don't have to do that. Do it however the hell you want, but don't just, don't just willy-nilly, you know, throw it over because it'll fall apart and then it'll be unattractive, right? But it'll still taste great, so it won't matter. But if you want the nice, aesthetically pleasing, round, voluptuous salmon patty, then, you know, get a nice cooked side and then flip it uh, with intention, as Dr. Wayne Dyer might say. Uh, or uh, Phil, Dr. Phil. Dr. Phil doesn't cook salmon patties though. The guy eats uh, McRibs or something. But you know, flip them. When it cooks on the other side, it won't take as long on the other side. And then there you have it. Just pull them off the skillet, and let them drain a little bit. And like I said, they're already cooked. It's already cooked in the can. It's like tuna, it's not raw salmon. You know, and there you have it. Awesome salmon patties that you can use for burgers or whatever the hell. Just serve them like this with a sauce. See how structurally sound they are? See how I can manhandle those things? But I love I love these as burgers. You know, to take a break from the beef burgers. Because I eat a lot of damn burgers. So I don't feel as guilty eating these. And I love it with mayonnaise and a nice thick slice of tomato and onion. But, you know, whatever the hell you like. And we got some, what is that? A little bit of roasted uh, potatoes there but super duper easy you know semi healthy yeah you know not as cheap as it used to be but give canned salmon a try you know let me know what you think and bon appetit and thanks for watching